Hi, this is Jim from Roughing It in Retirement, an engineer's perspective, where we are free from work and free for adventure. I'm coming from Wichita, Kansas, and I'm going to show a few videos about some of the trips that occurred during the summer. Uh, which the first one was from Western Kansas. Of you. So Kansas one time was covered by a shallow inland sea. So if you ever get to this part of the country you'll notice there's a lot of limestone. So this is all limestone here and not too far. There's a couple parks one is Little Jerusalem. Ooh, big spider one. How do I avoid that one? And so, like this channel, a lot of this is about the journey and not so much about the destination. So, the end result looks pretty nice. 
so can't complain but we got a good morning hike before the drive home So anyways, Kansas was an inland sea, so there's chalk formations. And if you dig further, further enough down, it seems like you'll hit limestone. So a couple of chalk formations near Lake Scott is a little Jerusalem State Park. It's a nice one. You can hike it, but you can't really get into the uh, chalk formations. Now there's another one called Monument Rock. I believe it's on private land, so please respect uh, the land there. But uh, uh, you can actually get up there and go under an arch, so it's pretty cool. So I definitely recommend that if you can. But uh, um, the other areas that I think are pretty cool, I love Wichita, I love Kansas. It's not a crowded state. I lived in uh, Houston, lived all over in California. And uh, I tell you, uh, so Kansas is perfect for me. So if you do go to Kansas uh, and you want to know about a little more about the inland seas and stuff, there's a city called Hutchinson, and they have a working salt mine, which is rather, rather fabulous. Uh, you actually go like eight, nine hundred feet underground, and uh, they have this thick layer of uh, salt. And you take a nice little tour. I think it's worth the money. Um, yeah, and when I took it last, they, they allow you to pay, take a piece of the uh, rock, uh, salt rock. I took one, probably about this, a little bigger than the size of my fist. And the cool thing is you can see an inclusion in there. And I don't know if it's an air inclusion or water inclusion, but it's probably been there for 50 million years. So I think that's pretty cool. So, um, well, thanks for watching. If you like the, uh, the video, Hit like and make any comments. Thanks.